When we're experiencing unwanted behaviours that challenge us in our sessions, it's easy to become frustrated and annoyed with our students. But advances in MRI and fMRI scanning, along with the work of Professor Sarah Jane Blakemore at the University of Cambridge, have identified some surprising findings when it comes to the adolescent brain. The adolescent brain is undergoing critical and profound growth and development and synaptic pruning right through the teenage years and often into the early 20s and sometimes 30s. Activity in the medial prefrontal cortex, the area of the brain that develops the ability to see things from other people's perspectives in order to guide behaviour and that stops us from taking excessive risks, for instance, decreases during adolescence. Whilst at the same time, the limbic system that's involved with emotion processing and reward processing including the rewarding feeling of taking risks, has been found to be hypersensitive in adolescents compared to adults. Part of our job as adults and educators is to create the conditions for learning that takes into account these massive changes that our students' brains are undergoing. By modelling the behaviour that we want to see, setting clear and consistent expectations, and above all else, having unconditional positive regard for our students.